Jelly Roll, a country music singer, says he regrets getting some facial tattoos. Even though Jelly Roll is having a blast, he knows how to maintain his modesty. Speaking enthusiastically about his most recent endeavor, the son of a sinner singer told Digital, I got a Super Bowl ad with Uber Eats. The craziest thing that is currently happening to me is that, in the commercial, Jelly Roll is organizing stuff in a restroom when he notices his reflection in the mirror. He expresses shock at the sight of his tattoos, saying, they're everywhere. And they're horrible. Have you heard the saying that every joke has a grain of truth? Regarding the idea behind the commercial, he said, there you go, but he didn't say which of his own tattoos he regretted. Jelly Roll had a fantastic Grammy weekend. She started the festivities at the 33rd Annual Music Hairs Person of the Year Gala, which honored John Bon Jovi, the founding member of the American rock band Bon Jovi and winner of the Grammy Award. Those guys wrote fearlessly on those albums, they would be so afraid to write that today, Jelly Roll remarked of Bon Jovi. It felt completely hooky. Everything about it was catchy and infectious, including the verse, the pre-chorus, and the hook, which felt like a double take. Amazing, astounding. He went on, I've been watching Clive Davis parties on documentaries since I was a kid and on movies and major motion picture films, and so many things, and to be here, this is all just unreal to me. Jelly Roll, real name Jason DeFord, testified before the Senate Banking Committee, fervently discussing the effects of drugs and acknowledging his own history as a dealer, saying, I was a part of the problem. As a man who wishes to contribute to the solution, I am standing here right now. He urged lawmakers to pass the Fend Off Fentanyl Act, legislation that targets Chinese chemical suppliers and Mexican drug cartels that traffic fentanyl. I am a stupid songwriter, you all. But I have firsthand witnessed this in a way most people have not. I encourage you all to not only pass this bill, but I encourage you to bring it up where it matters, at the kitchen table, he said in closing.